Hey everyone, hey, this is Andy from the Wolfpack here to do a review of the Nokia Lumia 900, the talk of CES 2012. Every tech site had this rated the top phone from CES 2012. I've been pestering AT&T, please send me this phone for review, and they were gracious enough to supply me this phone for review. I've been rocking this phone for the last week, and I love it. You can get your hands on this phone on April 8th. Happy Easter and Windows Phone with LTE. AT&T's first Windows Phone with LTE for $99.99. What a tremendous deal for such a spectacular phone for $99.99. So without further ado, let's crack this thing open and take a look at it. We have the uh, clear black, we have the black matte color here. And it also comes in a cyan blue. And on April 22nd, you can get the glossy white. So let's set that off the side. We have our SIM tool tray here. And we have our you know, promotional information, quick start guide, safety product information. And then we have a unique power adapter. You know, most of the power adapters now are square. I've never seen one that's round like this. Yeah, it's, you know, it's unique. You know, like kind of like the phone. The phone's unique in its shape and stuff. So uh, I don't like that it comes out the side. I'd sooner it come out the top when you're setting it in your power strip. That way, this one doesn't get in the way of the next one. This would have to be on the end. You know, yeah, it's a power adapter. So let's put that all away and get to the phone. That's what everyone wants to see. We have a 4.3 inch clear black AMOLED screen. The clear black part of it allows you to see the screen when you open it up so much easier in sunlight. So if you're someone that works outside like I am, that is a tremendous option. The polycarbonate body is mold injected with color. So no matter how deep you scratch it, you're still going to get black color. That is tremendous and it's also solid. This is a solid phone. This is a solid phone as I felt since the iPhone 4 4S. The difference being, I feel like I could take this, walk into my house, throw this on my counter, and not even have to worry about cracking the back of it like the iPhone 4 and the 4S, where you have to add usually a case. This one, I just don't feel like you need, you really would need to have to add a case. I may add a case, but the, I, I just don't, you know, you don't have that need. All right, so down here at the bottom, we have our back home and search capacitive buttons. On the side, we have our dedicated physical camera button. From the lock screen, you can push this button, hold it down, it will open up the camera application. You could quick take a picture, post it to Facebook, all from your lock screen. We have our power button here, or lock button. We have our up and down rocker keys here for volume. We have our SIM tray here, it has micro, U uh, micro SIM here, I have a micro USB here, come on focus, focus, and then we have our secondary microphone here, we have our 3.5 millimeter headphone jack here, on the back we have our Carl Zeiss 8 megapixel dual with dual LED flash, the camera is capable of 720p video, the camera takes spectacular pictures. Also inside it has an 1830 milliamp hour battery on 4G HSPA plus speeds I was able to get one day and four hours with light to moderate usage on LTE I was able to get 13 to 14 hours of light to moderate usage on LTE speeds. So on the front we have our one megapixel front facing camera that allows you to take you know do video conferencing through the Skype or the Tango uh, application or you can take self portraits or whatever you like to do with that down here at the bottom we have our speaker down here at the bottom with our microphone and so without further ado let's hit the power button here and you can see it kinda gives you some general information you got your calendar information here. Looks like here I've got I've got a voicemail here. I've got 21 emails, and it would show your text and different uh, notifications 
there along the bottom, missed calls, etc. So you can you can customize this backdrop here with a photo of your choice, or you can just keep what they gave you. That's what I did here. So all right, let's open it up and isn't it look wonderful you have your live tiles I love the live tile options uh, you can clearly see we go down here we have our the weather channel live tile application that is all a part of the Windows 7.5 mango I love the the software that's in this phone it's so smooth it's so easy to operate it's so easy to set up you have your me application which you could connect with your different social media uh, you can instantly post to uh, all your social media outlets from your me application you have um, go up here back up here at the top we have our open up the phone and you have visual voicemail now and so now you don't have to call in you've got it right there so I can play that okay and you you know uh, of course I'd have that up to my ear or whatever and uh, so you, you no longer have to push the one button I love this is actually I think AT&T's first Windows phone with visual voicemail so that option is a tremendous option and we got somebody uh, messaging me through Facebook there and then we have our texting here and some of your Facebook chats will come through your your messaging app as well uh, sometimes they work sometimes it, it doesn't go through there I'm not quite sure if it has to do with uh, having you know like my computer closed down so that it only sends to my phone uh, I'm not sure why that works but it as you get to using the Windows phone it seems to the notification at least from Facebook seems to work better the browser the Internet Explorer browser I love the Internet Explorer browser you can set this to desktop version okay that is a that is so valuable to me because here we got we got Engadget's site here and we can go we got favorites go over here to favorites and go over to say let's go to Techno Buffalo and we can boom bring it up their site this is running of course off of uh, uh, Wi-Fi here right now but you can see it, it brought up the sites um, it's already loaded pinch to zoom works really well no lag there you can flip up and down you know there's no it really works well with the 1.4 megahertz processor and the 512 megabytes of RAM that are inside this phone. You also have 16 gigabytes of storage in this phone, and uh, that's well enough uh, for anything that you're going to be using it for. Now, if you're going to start putting a ton of videos and stuff on it, you know, it's a phone. <laughs> it's you know, but uh, 16 meg 16 gigabytes has always been enough for me. So. All right, but the I love you know the settings. You can go into settings here, and uh, see down here you can select desktop version or mobile version. I love that option. So all right, let's go out of that, and then we have down here you can have a unified email. I have all mine grouped together, and I have pinned to my start page uh, instantly. It goes from Internet Explorer to our page instantly. I love that option. We also have the marketplace here. This is the marketplace as of today. Uh, a site is reporting that the marketplace has over 80,000 applications. They are pushing this. Microsoft and Nokia are pushing. Uh, to get more applications in, I, I, I expect to have at least probably a hundred thousand applications by summer. Uh, Nokia and Lumia, they're even uh, Nokia and, and uh, Microsoft, they're even pushing, uh, they're even paying developers to uh, uh, get uh, their some of the top applications over to the Windows platform. You know, truthfully, it has everything that really you want from the Windows. Uh, you can go to the let's go to the apps let's go to all 
here we go and let's go top so we have angry birds fruit ninja angry birds space is coming soon splinter cell conviction and you can see some of the top applications of uh, the uh, marketplace here um, I've had no trouble the only application that I miss that I use on my iPhone was mint I'm sure that's coming soon uh, we have our free applications Facebook YouTube Adobe Xbox, Xbox Live extras um, you have some basketball ESPN uh, Twitter as you could see SkyDrive you know for storage Nokia Drive Nokia has a ton of uh, free applications the drive by drive uh, turn by turn directions I used that over the weekend up in San Antonio and uh, it worked tr tremendously well so let's go out of that let's go over here and uh, then you have you know your live tiles here's some it goes through I picked some favorites that I liked and it will go through each of those photographs it just keeps flipping through all the different photographs these are some pictures I took at SeaWorld in in San Antonio over the weekend um, you can see I have Evernote uh, here let's go over here to the side here and here's all the applications uh, they go in alphabetical order. You have your Amazon Kindle, Amazon Mobile, AT&T Code Scanner, AT&T Navigator, AT&T Radio, AT&T Uverse. These applications don't get in the way whatsoever. You can actually you can delete these. Uh, let's actually go back here. And uh, whoops, there we go. Let's go back over here and if you actually push down on one of them you can uninstall it you can uninstall the the AT&T applications that came with it but truthfully you know they don't get in the way uh, they're a tremendous asset to the phone uh, here was a, an application I use S bandwidth I took some LT speeds I got top speeds of 18 19 megabytes down 8 mega megabytes up uh, that is tremendous speeds on LTE. I'm not sure if bandwidth the app is is uh, uh, made to be work with LTE. So uh, I'm not sure if those speeds were true. But uh, hey, that's still pretty good speeds for a uh, phone. All right. I uh, tried some other speed test apps. That one didn't work very well. And we have Creative Studio. You can go in and, uh, you know, any photos you want to add something or highlight or lighten up or, you know, take away red eye if, if that occurs. Um, you have your eBay application, ESPN, Evernote, Facebook, Flickr, Flickster. Um, you have Get Glue for Windows. Uh, here's your Google Voice application. Uh, it, it sends notifications. Um, I don't use Google Voice a lot, but a lot of people do, and that's a that's a, an important part. People have asked me, does it have Google Voice? And yes, it does, and this application is rated very high. It works very well. All right. We have our IMBD app for movies, uh, Keeper for, you know, putting your passwords and such in. Um, then we have my the my AT and T. You can pay your bill from there. Uh, Netflix, Nokia Drive, which was was wonderful to use for uh, turn by turn navigation. Um, over here, let's see, SkyDrive, Skype, Spotify, a, a very popular application net right now. Uh, Tango Video Calls, Twitter, the Weather Channel, White Pages. Uh, and YouTube and uh, Yellow Pages. Uh, just about every application that you would want is in there. Uh, the only thing I would say, if you're a heavy Facebook user, the notifications for messages are just kind of, you know, dicey. They seem to be starting to work a little bit better. Um, as I keep with this phone, uh, it's been a week over, a little over a week with this phone, they seem to come quicker. They're a little bit slow. I mean, I still have my iPhone, and uh, the iPhone gets a much quicker uh, 
minutes sometimes uh, quicker than than you get them on here now you can you can pin your messaging your Facebook messaging to the start and go from there and look at them but uh, you know uh, it's not as as easy you know boom you want them to come up and notify you quickly and though like today it seems like they're coming a lot quicker you saw a couple of them post right there um, I didn't I felt my phone vibrate only like a few seconds on my side my iPhone uh, before they came on here so it is getting better uh, let's see here alright that's about it but it runs on Windows 7.5 Mango uh, this is a tremendous buy from AT&T for $99.99 uh, I don't think you can go wrong with this phone I love the speed you can see it's snappy uh, it goes you know you can go up and down uh, you get over here to your browser you can get into your browser look at your pinch to zoom works really well you know there's no checkerboarding uh, you can flip up and down between your applications uh, push here you can copy the link go back over to my Facebook page paste that link and put that story up for everyone to see I love the browser part in fact the Internet Explorer browser is probably better than the one that's in their computers so um, the search over here you can get like search you can search different you know for different things for being uh, you can even uh, uh, listen for music uh, like Shazam does. There is a Shazam app in the app store. I did not buy it because Bing has it and it works really well. Um, over here uh, you had your local scout. Uh, this goes scouts out like all the close restaurants um, and you can see them right here and it rates them. Some of them are rated good you know and you know nearby you can look hey what restaurant can I go to here nearby and that is a I like that that application as well so um, so without further ado give the Nokia Lumia 900 a try I think you're gonna like this it, it has 4G um, HSPA plus up to 21 megabytes down uh, LTE speeds uh, if you're in an LTE, LTE area and uh, uh, the one thing I did notice is compared to my iPhone, I get out when I, on my job, I drive out of the city and close to the Texas-Mexico border. The signal down there is not that great. The Nokia Lumia was able to hold a better signal. In fact, I got into some houses down there and uh, uh, the iPhone had no service and my Nokia Lumia did have service. So. Uh, it does hold a signal a little bit better than the uh, the iPhone 4S, you know. Although you know, the, you know, it's nothing against the iPhone at all. But uh, for me, that's that's an invaluable tool when people are trying to get a hold of me and I'm in a client's ha home. I do home health, is what I do, and so for them to be able to get a hold of me because I've got signal bars is very very important. Uh, so give the Nokia Lumia 900 for $99 I mean you got with you can take it back within 30 days if you don't like it give it a try uh, you use um, on your PC you use Z Zoom for PC to connect and sync on on a Mac you'll do use Windows phone connector for Mac uh, to sync uh, you can sync all everything your songs from iTunes your photos from iPhoto uh, your, your your videos and uh, so uh, there's there's no problems with that um, so give the Nokia Lumia from AT&T for $99 a try I think you're gonna like this phone I thank you for attending my review of the Nokia Lumia 900 thanks and good night